is two vowels put together to make a different sound. And the O and I, when you put them together, they make the OI sound. Everybody say OI. 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 Okay, let's say it one time all together. Ready? OI. Okay, now if you see an O and an I put together, and you hear the OI sound, most of the time it's going to be in the middle of the word or at the beginning of the word. Like in the word oil, or boil, or foil, okay? Addie, Addie, can you think of some? Say you will do. I had it. I had it, now I lost it. Now, you will see this at the beginning or in the middle. Most of the time you'll not see this at the end. There might be a few words, but most of the time, at the end of the word is when you'll have the oi sound. Like in the word boy, or toy, or troy, or toy, toy. okay? Toy. But sometimes you'll see oi in the middle. And I really like how L-E-S had the word loyal. Loy is in the middle of that word. The O-Y is in the middle of it. So sometimes it will be in the middle, okay? So let's watch this first, and then we'll practice it, okay? The sound of oi. We enjoy singing. Oops, sorry. Was three. A lot of times the oi at the end. 
end with the OY. A lot of times those are just short words. And they just have to use letters. Are you going to call it? You don't have to. Yeah. Okay. Now, what we are going to do is I'm going to quickly pass these out. We are going to, um, I'm going to have you do the, these on your own. But I want to give the, actually, let me do the directions first. And then I will pass them out so that you can just get right to work, okay? So when you get your paper, you'll put your name at the top. Then, in the little box, it says two letters blended together can stand for one vowel sound. The letters O-Y and O-I can stand for the vowel sound in boy and coil. Okay, so Carson, Charlotte, Ingrid, look up here. I mean, Kinsley. You are going to read each sentence. Circle the word with the vowel sound you hear in boy. So I'm looking for the oi sound. Write the word on the line and circle the letters that spell the vowel sound. So I'm going to read number one, and I want you to listen for the oi sound, and I want you to use your eyes to look for oi or oi. Okay, look for these two. Right, number one says, the girl plays with a toy truck. Aria, what word it has the oi sound? Toy. Toy, so come up here, Aria. She's going to do the first, first example for us. She's going to circle toy. Oh, one second, Aria. I thought it was ready, but it wasn't. Toy. Try it now. Circle toy. Now, what's the next thing she needs to do? Everybody? Write it on the line. All right, write it on the line. That's the second thing. Now, there's one more thing she needs to do. Do you remember what you have to do, Arda? You're not going to underline. You're going to circle the letters that spell the vowel sound. So she's either going to circle O-Y or O-I. Which one? O-Y. And that would be perfect. This is easy. This is easy. So what you're going to do is you're going to do two, three, four on your own. Then, when you get done, does everybody understand what to do? I'll put this back up in a minute. When you get done, you are going to do this diagraph, sort, and color. So you are going to look for the words, and you're going to solve them out. Point. Point has an O-I, so I'm going to color that word blue. O-Y would be red. So your key is up here. You get this done, and this done, hand it in. This must be done because I'm going to grade it. This is for a treat. So make sure you get it done and hand it in for a treat. Okay? Um, this is due by the end of the week. So if you don't get it done today, you have until Friday. Okay? All right. I'm going to pass this out.